So Rental just launched this year, like I said, the Motor Show. First of, first of April launch for a brand new car for us. It's been very, very well received, I have to say. Very busy show. Good to see so many folk out here. Uh, everybody avoiding the snow yesterday. It's, it's good to see. Uh, but yeah, very busy show. Very happy with it. Late 2014 Quadzilla Z8 ADV side by side buggy and it's road legal. So obviously drive it on the road, take it off road. It's two wheel drive standard, then you can switch it to four wheel drive and it's got diff locks as well, so it's pretty unstoppable. It was good, yeah. There's a really good variety of vehicles in this year. So. It's, it's good to see all the members of the public having a look and it gives them a chance to compare vehicles as well. It's been, the road on foot on fantastic show, um, loads of cars about, uh, loads of people about, gives those people an opportunity to come in and see everything all at once, people don't always get an opportunity to go around all the dealerships, they don't have a good time, um, so the weekend coming it Saturday and Sunday with people working, families, it's a great night for everyone, you can come and see the new models and Like you said, the VK36, um, we, we've always tried to have something as a centrepiece and um, with the big polar Hilux a couple of times ago and a little eye go crazy last time round and uh, the racing car, it's drawn people in, it's like Toyota's busy, it's people just <laughs> want to sit in the car. But. It's been a good show, I think the main one, after what they did it two years ago, uh, the time this year, the one time most heads from the south, the much young man going around the river along the front. It's pretty funny to cross to the pool. Yeah, it's been a good show. We had a lot of interest. Uh, the new tyre being released next month for a much younger class of climate. It's going to be a winter, summer, all, all year around the tyre. It'll be perfect for sitting on bags and conditioning out of the bags and shit on the front. I'm just here today uh, as a volunteer with the North Road Mitsubishi promoting the benefits of electric vehicles. I've got information from the Energy Saving Trust uh, showing the benefits of electric vehicles and how companies can put in uh, publicly available charging points for which there are public grants available. So we're hoping to build up a network of electric vehicle charging points throughout Shetland to make EV usage much more easy. The easiest way is on the Energy Saving Trust website or if you contact Transport Scotland, there's full information available.